All right. Oh, nice. Even better. Yeah, okay. All um, right, so welcome back, everyone, to another LIYC locked in your character. Well, you're not actually locked in your character. And joining me on commentary today is Abby. I'm here to uh, make sure that Zero isn't going to ask for nightmare buffs. Buff uh, I'll probably commentate a little bit in between, but I'm mostly there for that purpose and that purpose only. <laughs> so, whenever you hear me talk, just ignore it, okay? <laughs> but yeah. But uh, aside from that, we have a really, possibly really good match today. We have yeah. uh, the, the, men, the men of focus, commitment, sheer fucking will. Eternal Dragon, <laughs> who's, who's come to, who's come to, you know, uh, take revenge on whoever slapped his dog, yeah? yeah but no. whoever, but the person standing in his way today is the uh, the Dark Queen, the uh, the Captain of the Lupin, the mm -hmm. uh, the Ace, the Ace Slayer, Valanya. <laughs> yes. Uh, not only that, Valanya is also wielding a chainsaw this time around. So <laughs> yeah, if you if you seen in the uh, LIYC Discord, she just uh, just uh, uh, put up a, a gif of um, of a little girl wielding a chainsaw. So she is absolutely <laughs> aiming to not only laser yes, she's Eternal out. Dragon, <laughs> she's 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 going to chainsaw him to pieces. Yes, exactly. But Eternal Dragon, like you said, is like John Wick. He is unstoppable. <laughs> This, Absolutely. Even I mean, with a chainsaw, this is going to be a very difficult task for Vaughn. Uh, uh, All right, got let's, the screen, go. let's get but, into it. But yeah, I mean, I mean, we've seen great things from both these players. Eternal yes. Dragon, like if you if you did not see his last run at Meltdown, this he run he ran an absolute marathon through losers bracket all the way to top eight. Damn. Like that when, like, when we say when we say that this is a man of focus, mm -hmm. he is a man of uh, focus. Yeah, I have I, I've had the pleasure to play one of these first attends against him as well, and that ended up being ten to nine for me. But like that, that was so close, it's so much fun to <laughs> fight against him. I should probably ask him yeah. for games more often. Man, this, this guy is really fun. Ooh! Oh, we're going straight oh, with the Wang. Yeah, he's going to try out his other character. I mean, uh, we we saw we saw this uh, against uh, Humpy Jin where. His Huang was, uh, you know, uh, was was kind of kind of uh, doing doing the work he needed to, yeah. but then like like uh, in the end, you know, he had to like uh, um, pull out the big guns, uh, pull, uh, pull out the Mitsu. Yeah, I mean, I, I can I can understand uh, trying to go for the Wang because uh, playing playing Caliber against Zhang Hua is kind of a, kind of a pain. Let's be honest, this character yeah. is not very fun to play against. So why play Caliber when you can play Yu Gi Oh? Right? Absolutely. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh that was disgusting. This is this oh, is oh, this yeah. is the dance. This is the dance of dark love. Yep. Alright, it's looking really good in this first yeah. round for Valhanya. Oh, good punish. Very nice. And Valhanya taking it quite comfortably. So this is yes. like a, a, a matchup of uh, a character that can counter practically anything you throw at her. And yes. uh Huang has to deal well, not deal. He has to he has to manage uh, life force and talismans, yes. and has a really good solid uh, toolkit, right? Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, if you don't really, yeah, you know, overall as well. Like yeah. if you don't really understand how to deal with the character, you can get like uh, really janked out. Yes, and even if you understand how to deal with the character, overall this character is very solid, very strong. But it obviously, Absolutely. it's. Yeah, I think it also takes a really good player, so it's uh, yeah. kind of a double-edged sword. And there we go, second round to Eternal Sim Dragon. Spending Absolutely. a lot of talismans already, which I think is a good thing. I think it is a very... Like, if you can spend the talismans, if you f think you can do something good with it, it's very good to spend as many as possible. I mean, even then, he's... He's spending them, but he's still being very conservative with them. It's like he's only sticking to like minus two, minus four. Oh, minus four. Here we go. <laughs> I don't think that he's not going to be like uh, be like going for minus nine. I don't think. No. no. Round but, two. All right. But you know, if you if you're confident in this kind of game, minus nine is going to be the way to go. I think minus nine is actually really good for as long as you are one hundred percent aware of the risk that you are taking. Is mm -hmm. 
uh, it, the, the damage output that you get, the mix-ups that you get, are absolutely absurd mm -hmm. overall if you go minus nine. <laughs> absolutely. But you know, uh, back to Huang's sort of um, playstyle. <laughs> oh, just, no, just, no, just let's no, rip! No. Yeah, no, whatever. A six, I don't care. I mean, I mean, yeah. It's like, like we often talk about how 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 patient of a man uh, Eternal Dragon can be, and has and has demonstrated in sets where uh, players like uh, Humpy Jin will just like to let things rock. Mm -hmm. But Eternal Dragon is also a man where he knows where it's time to press, and I yeah. don't give a crap what you're going to do. Yeah, exactly. And Valhanya is like he, uh, she is definitely a kind of player that is good enough at this game that that kind of thing would be entirely unexpected and thus mm -hmm. it worked out for him. Well, there we go. That's three rounds to one. Pretty good performance from both players so far. Um, and, and you know, uh, you know, uh, Val Valanya is also that kind of a player who, you know, can at times be slow to start off, but once she gets you de uh, down pat, she really yeah. does make uh, yeah. Zhang Guo's toolkit really shine and make it look really, mm -hmm. uh, really... Uh, Really strong. Yes, I, uh, it's kind of funny because I feel like both of these players are very much the type that need time, right? Yeah. I think when I, whenever I fight either of them, it's just like early on I might be winning a lot, but then as time goes on, I feel my, I see myself losing way more often. Mm -hmm. So yeah. It'll be interesting to see who does that the best in all oh, of these. Straight into the Liu Kang kicks. Yep. 6 AA, making sure that Valhanya is not able to step at all. <laughs> yeah, that's something that um, Wang might force you to do. It's like, you don't get the move for free at all. Mm. It, his range is just really good, so back steps, uh, side steps, it's just always a risk. Gets caught by the Raiden Lightning. Yep. Re really strong on block, re even stronger on hit. Yeah, on hit you get a plus 18. So you got a combo. Oh, doesn't go for the correct punish. Yes, yeah, uh, Zhangma actually gets a crouch throw that because it's minus 12 for crouch. It's very nice. Absolutely, but it's like, oh, in, unless you, in, unless this is something you lab specifically, you you might, you would probably never know that Wang's AAA is minus yeah. 12 but recovers crouch. Exactly. Uh, this is one of the, the few scenarios where something is minus 12 and Nightmare actually gets something really nice out of it. And Siegfried oh, gets absolutely fuck cool. <laughs> yeah, but he, that's fine. We don't care. <laughs> yeah, of course it's fine. We do not sympathize with uh, Siegfried players. No, no, we do not. Anyway, uh, Eternal Dragon seems to be uh, not afraid of going minus. That That is a good sign, if you ask me. And he is in the, well, not the privacy. He's looking a lot better for her now. Oh, wait, that's not a punish. Yeah, it is yeah, a punish. That is minus 12 on block. That was a uh, good punish. Good, good aware punish from Valhanya. She does seem to know uh, at least a tidbit of the matchup, so it's uh, mm -hmm. there's hope yet. And there's the first nunchate of the first to ten. Yep. We will be seeing a lot of that. I'm glad I have yeah. to sound off. Oh my. And uh, Eternal Dragon, you know, uh, knows when to uh, press his frames, when to press his um, mm -hmm. his buttons. But you know, this is a, a character against uh, Shang Guo where pressing could quite potentially be your doom. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But if there's I... one thing if that's going to uh, like uh, see Eternal Dragon through this first to ten, it's his impeccable movement. Oh yeah! Whew. As we just Beautiful. see, as we just as just been <laughs> just been demonstrating. That better. I, I'm. You know what I think is beautiful about the set so far? Just from both sides, I'm seeing a lot of the M word. Neutral. Neutral. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> and Wang is a character that excels at that. I think. So is uh, Zhang Hua, just in a very different way. Zhang Hua is just like, you can't play big against Zhang Hua when Absolutely she has meter and you're about to die. It doesn't, it doesn't work. If you, if she gets a single punch on you, you're dead. So mm -hmm. she forces you to play small, and Wang is a character that wants to play small. So I can definitely also understand this character. Really I mean, well. yeah, I mean, is a character that can play small, but when he wants to, when he wants to play big, oh, holy shit, is it fucking this big? This character has all kinds of cheap tricks up his sleeves, depending on where you are with your talismans mm -hmm. uh, for playing big, uh, which I think is a very nice balance. Just you could, you could almost say, one. you could almost say that he has a card up his sleeve. <laughs> 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 oh Jesus. Oh, he missed the combo there, it's unfortunate. 
I see him not uh, not going for any punishes on the uh, what do you call it AAB, even though he's minus fourteen. Mm -hmm. It's a bit I don't know, it's a bit unfortunate, but at the same time, it is working out in his favor because he is not dying to it either. So I guess that is worth. Oh, good ATI. Ooh. Yes, that is something he has been falling from for, uh, for from the start. He should be trying to go for some more horizontals to whiff punish. Uh, these moves in particular, mm -hmm. I suppose. You cannot stop me, and this is the second nunchate of the game. Mm -hmm. Yep. So now we see that uh, Valania is very slowly but surely adapting to uh, Eternal Dragon's yeah, uh, definitely, definitely. Uh, sort of uh, tactics uh, with Wang, but good whiff punish right there. I was one thing. Uh, one thing though, I'm um, going into this. I was expecting Valhanya to uh, take the lead first. I'm already very happy to see Eternal Dragon uh, show up as well as he does. Mm -hmm. uh, as he does. So uh, this is probably promising to be a very nice set. Ooh, good interrupt. Yes, very nice. No duck on the three uh, on three AK. Mm-hmm. But there it is, like, like uh, Eternal Dragon's like patience does tend to pay off when you need it to, but you know, yes. uh, Deborah Melania just changes the entire pace of the game. Yes, but uh, at, at this point, if he does a single minus 12 move, he is dead. Mm. At the same time, uh... Oh, yeah, well, no, oh there it is! I, 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 was, I was about to say, just before that, uh, he landed the 3B, that would have been his death, but yeah. here he goes. But uh, one, but one, like, one other thing uh, to, to notice that uh, Eternal, Eternal Dragon is doing quite fairly often as well, and it's that when he uses the um, the 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 blue the blue life force dagger moves, right? Mm -hmm. This deals an insane amount of uh, guard damage yes. on hit. It is. Uh, I think it's about twenty guard, uh, twenty percent. Fifteen, fifteen percent, fifteen percent. So like like, yeah, like moves, right. yeah, like uh, moves like like a four KB moves like yes. a two three six B all deal uh, a very 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 large amount of fifteen percent mm. on hit. Yes, yes, it's very very obscene. I, he's got all the four BB punishes on lock though. I can mm. uh, can definitely respect that. Oh, good duck didn't get anything out of it. Oh. And there's that uh, patient movement from Eternal Dragon. He's yes. got... Oh, he's going to go straight for the minus nine. <laughs> Why? <laughs> I, I don't know. Well, whatever. He, did, he didn't care. He needed something. Yeah. He, uh, I but, think he felt like he needed but, something. But also, as demonstrated, great patience from Valhalla yes, as well. Exactly. Stepping... Okay. Well, knows how to, how to uh, just be like, you know what? This character's mix-ups are not that scary. I can just stand here. I can just block. It's fine. I don't have to go in for another mix-up. And that's paying off. Absolutely. And this is something that Valandi can do exceptionally well. Mm -hmm. Like, you know, yeah. uh, she plays a character that's, sort of, that's just designed to absolutely frustrate you. But if it's not frustrating you enough... She'll make it frustrate you, and then, <laughs> and then when, when, when you reach that, when you reach boiling point, mm -hmm. this is when, this is when the, uh, uh, when all the gimmicks come out, and there is absolutely yes. nothing you can do because you'll, you get more mad, and then you start uh, like not, not reacting to the stuff that you need to, mm -hmm. and before you know it, yeah, you've lost like, uh, like uh, two or three mix-ups, and you've just lost like, like uh, eighty percent of your health. Yes, I think uh, the only way how I ever win against this character is just when I get into a, uh, like into any match against the Zhonghua, I just think the only thing I have to do is not get mad. Because then I'm most likely winning. Especially because mm -hmm. I'm playing Mina and Mina's really fucking cheap. Yeah. So I can pull out uh, pull a win out either way, right? I'm not afraid of uh, of needing to make a comeback. So as long as I'm not mad, I'm probably sitting tight. Absolutely. Another However, it's you... a bit more complicated because if uh, Zhang Wang manages to get a life lead, it is a lot harder for Wang to actually um, do a combat. I mean, absolutely. And you, you know what? Uh, like, uh, the, the the idea to play against uh, Zhang Wang is you you want to keep her at, uh, at bay and you do not want to let her get in. Yes. But, you know, uh, both these characters have like a pretty similar kind of range. So it's like you have to dance mm. around your own range while dancing around her range as well. Yes. But you know, you can't stop her. And there's nope. the third Nunchate of the game, and, and what's the mix-up? And karaoke, yeah. And here it is! Unfortunate. <laughs> Did you guess right? Too bad, you guessed wrong. Yep. I could have GI'd it, but yeah. It's, it's, in the heat of the moment, that is not an easy thing to do. <laughs> it's really not. Also, something that is infuriating about fighting against Valhanya in particular is she knows how to place these step ducks. You, you, can, you will see in the neutral just all the time, whenever there's a moment where she can. 
she will try to go for a step to G. And a character like Wang doesn't have much for it, right? So it's it's generally kind of painful to deal with. Yeah. Um, just like but, that. But you know, as we said before, Valania does start off slow. And just like yeah. that, it's two to two. Exactly. That was a very fast, well, I would say combat. Mm. Yeah. And so at this point, you have to wonder, is Eternal Dragon going to stick with Wang for maybe the next two or three games uh, and, and think like, oh, is he going to be like, maybe it's time to change? You know? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say he oh, will Oh, no, he's going to stick with him. I think he will play him for half the, half the set. Half the set, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. No, it's going to be first to fight with Wang and then first to fight with Mitsu. Exactly, exactly. Mostly because I can understand... I think this is... He's not the only Mitsu player that is also playing Wang. I think uh, Skill is also the same. He's also playing Wang. I mean, I mean, but Skill doesn't play the game anymore. No, true enough. <laughs> so you know, uh, so it, uh, it it might it might not be uh, might not be uh, the first or the last Wang, but he's definitely the last samurai. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 I'm a Mitsu player now. <laughs> oh shoot! You know what? So am I. Yeah, we're all Mitsu players. Um, <laughs> That freebie is kind of kind of tasty. So. Oh, but you know what? Uh, Eternal Dragon does learn. You know, a uh, good delay on the six six B. Yeah, very nice, very nice. Didn't manage to get the follow up, unfortunately. But good punish, is. good throw break. Ooh. And you know, uh, this game is probably going to be like uh, the make or break for Eternal Dragon, whether he uh, opts to stick with Wang or you know just go straight to Mitsu. Because like, if you've like what, lost like three in a row after losing uh, two. Well, after yeah. winning two, sorry, this probably yeah. be the like the time to change. Yeah, yeah, I agree. Um, another thing is uh, in chat, Valmuffin is saying that the the matchup for um, for Mitsu is very frustrating for uh, mm. uh, against Yangwa, which I can understand. But at the same time, uh, Mitsu is definitely his main character. There is always a value in playing your best character in a matchup, absolutely. Even if you think the matchup itself is not that good. I noticed that with myself as well. <laughs> Gets retracked oh. on the throw, and this is going to be death. Disgusting. <laughs> you cannot stop me. He's trying to be trying to be clever and be like, ah, oh, the AGI, right? I'm gonna 1K hold, and that will kill you. But uh, nope. But you know, it's like like it, it 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 is still a testament to like Eternal Dragon's uh is uh, impeccable movement, his incredible patience. Yeah. It's just he's up against Shangwa, and she does mm. frustrate you a lot. Yes, yes. And I mean, his ideas aren't wrong. It's just they're not working out quite as they're, well. They're, 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 not, they're not wrong, they're just not right <laughs> against exactly, the Shang exactly. Not right enough. <laughs> <laughs> you have to be even more correct than usual. You have to be corrector. And, you know, Valhania is now, is like, uh, you, 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 you can see the speed of how, how the small caliber is just, like, now increasing to, to, to like, mid, medium, um... Uh, Medium caliber? Yes. And there's like eventually and there oh, and there comes the big caliber! Six, six B, yeah. Yeah, you... I think he's trying he's trying to backstep a lot, which is like uh, mm. I suppose it's a Mitsu thing, but also Zhang Wu has a really good tool for that. She can just six six B your backstep. Absolutely. Not a, not a huge issue for her, mm -hmm. surprisingly. So the question is, uh, will Eternal Dragon stick? With Wang for maybe one or two more games, or will he go uh, with what he's comfortable with? I wonder. Uh, well, you know, we could we could just be entirely wrong, right? Um, could oh, oh, there never mind, it is. Never mind. The last I was about to, in the house. I was about to say that maybe for this, uh, uh, this would be like an experiment for him. But uh, mm. I'm entirely wrong. He is going for the Mitsu. I respect it. I uh, managed to already get two games on Wang. That's already worth a lot. But Absolutely. I mean, I mean, I mean, you know, in in a tournament setting, which is usually a first to two, first to three, yeah, he would you won. know. Yeah. I mean, you, I mean, you, you, you would have won. Exactly. And like, it's it's obvious. Uh, your adaptation is gonna gonna be different. Absolutely. Uh, so it's like, uh, and you know, uh, this will probably be like a a, a fresh. Uh, oh wait, that's not a ring out. Ah, not a ring out. Thank God. But Thank you know, you. No, this is this is like a general dragon can possibly like be a uh, refreshed after the five games. He's uh, spent with mm -hmm. Wang, you know, a uh, new character, uh, new, 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 new neutral, new footsies, yes. you know, and with a character that he's uh, comfortable with. And, you know, Valhania now has to sort of like uh, uh, oh, very nice. re relearn how to, pl how to play against the Eternal Dragon's yeah. character. But yeah. on it, well, his playstyle, but on a different character. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But that said, you play his Tadlos a lot. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. I mean, 
it, this is a very different Mitsu. So I don't know. Absolutely, about. absolutely. And obviously, like she will have like the knowledge things like that. That was a very good call, but it will be a very different matchup. And perhaps the fact that she plays against uh, Tadlos so much. Uh, oh, oh, we've been no. disconnected from the stream. Oh God, no. network error. It begins. Where? <laughs> Where? <laughs> so in the meantime, by pressing exclamation mark donate. Oh yeah. Give you all these players your shekels. Do it. Your shekels. Your you're not gonna, okay. Let's be honest here. Let's be honest here. You're not going to use your money well. So donate it to these players who, if they know how to play a game well, they surely would know how to use money well. But you know what the best thing is? Even if you don't know how to use money well, you can keep that money and you can donate the free money that you don't know how to yeah. use well. Exactly. And give it to players that do know how to use free money well, you know? Yeah. Free money is something everyone knows how to use well because obviously it's free. You can't even waste it. So, what are you waiting for? Use the coupon codes. I will do it's, that right it's, now. It's so free, you could almost call it zero. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, we may as well call it Abby. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, don't donate your Abbies. Yep, please be an Abby. Uh, donate the fact that you're free and that the codes are also free. Donate uh, your babies. Yes, exactly. You can. We're, we are having uh, technical difficulties, which we hopefully can be. Uh, Fixed uh, soon. Oh, oh is Steam God. is Steam actually down? Oh, let me have a look. If it is the same case for me, uh, for me, I'm still online. Connect your Tingu. Yeah. As Vile Muffin is saying, um, donate your babies. But uh, no, you can't donate your babies. But what you can do is have a child. Have them old enough to use the internet. And then you can actually. No, uh, what you need to do is find, use the code. is find find the nearest woman, procreate with her, and then have child, and then donate the child. No, 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 no. no. You, you ask the child to use the coupon codes. That's how simple it is. And then you donate the child. And then you donate the woman. And then you, uh, don and then you donate yourself. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. Donate, donate your organs. Yes. And then, you know, give them to the locked in your character. <laughs> There's no more virtuous cause than that. All right. Uh, all right. We are we are back uh, right. as soon as soon as possible. Sell child, don't need profits, as Vile Muffin correctly states. Why are you talking Russian? I do not know. Damn. But it's really fun. Hmm. I see. Uh, can I call you Boris then? You can call me Boro. Boro. Dog great Boro. Dog great Boro. Yet. I think I can uh, I can live with that. So the question is, do do we uh, do the same rounds or do we do entirely different round? Oh. Yeah, Eternal Dragon took the first round, right? Yes, exactly. Very well. Do we do the same be, stage? Does it have to be the same stage? Yeah. Okay. Ah. Gotcha. But you know, if there was if there was uh, anything else uh, to take away from this, it's uh, give uh, Soul Calibur rollback. Please, look ball. I mean, no, exactly. This was just Steam. <laughs> Very well, add add rollback to Steam. Yes. <laughs> Please, I guess. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, sure. We've got rollback Steam. Give rollback to Steam so that it becomes actual Steam, not smoke. Like a small, like like small buff that you that you get from vaping. Mm hmm. 
Well, the small buff you'll get when your when your uh, when your grandma does fart. I see. <laughs> uh, unfortunately, I have no idea how to reply to any of this. The shrine of your dick. Uh, um, yeah. Haha, <laughs> one out! <laughs> one out? <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> sure. <laughs> yes. Yeah, one for Eternal Dragon. Haha, <laughs> you just got one out! <laughs> One fort? Goddamn! The Valhalla is in the lead. <laughs> One fort! <laughs> right, let's hope that this does not throw a, throw a wedge in either of these players' momentum. And it helps that I think uh, neither of them were like necessarily dominating, dominating. the other. Yes, because uh, Valhalla was was dom dominating when it was on Wang, but once Mitsu came into the picture, uh, everything yeah. changed. So yeah. perhaps this is the best point where we can have Dot Cal Caliber happen. It might be a blessing in disguise. You know, I don't think I can I can I can look <laughs> at uh, Eternal Dragon's uh, name as ED because now I just see Ed. Ed Bully. <laughs> no Ed. <laughs> Ed Bully. <laughs> yes. Yes. Uh, let's see if Ed has a plan for uh, for X. <laughs> I mean, we saw in the first we saw in the first round that he does indeed have a plan for X. Okay, yeah, I'd love to see it. You know, there, there's a oh, great interrupt. Ooh, yeah, good interrupt. And this is what we talked about uh, before: Eternal Dragon knowing that when he has the frames, will just take his turn. Yes, exactly. It is just in general a lot more comfort comfortable in forcing his aggression, which mm. is at least now is paying off mm. pretty well. Oh, well, well, there comes the Schmix. No, uh, back throw break? Oh! Oh, just out of range for the punish! Well, I'm being really there, patient right there, now, but he's not one more- Oh, <laughs> that was a great option. As much as I find 4 for b to be a disgusting move, this was a very good use of it. Beautiful. That's absolutely- That must be gutted, must be gutted, you know, you think! You think you've got range, and then and then you know Shangwa just jumps back uh, to the edge of the universe. Yeah. I think uh, Eternal Dragon might be a bit, uh, might have been a bit too afraid to go for the one BBs at the round end, or expecting it to be too obvious, and that gave uh, Valhanya another chance at life. Oh, and, th two, and two, this three. and this the Valhanya that we all have come to have, have all co co come to know and see. When you think it's your turn, Valhanya is like, no, I'ma sh that shit down. Yep, exactly. No exceptions! You don't get the press. It's always my turn, Jungla says. I'm the only one who gets to play. Exactly. And play we shall! Alright, soul charge time. Let's see what we got. Oh, Valhanya decides to go in to just shut down the soul charge. Oh, there comes a 1k B! Another 1k! What are we- Good Oh, step. another 1k B! And you know, you, you, I think I think Val, Val is stiffing out that three B. It's coming. Oh, that oh, that's really unfortunate. Really that was meant to be meant to be a two two A, but you know, sometimes you just get you just yeah. get you know a step step jump A. Wasn't it a jump B? Uh, it doesn't matter. He was trying to go for the two two B with punish, I think, or the two two A with punish. Uh, it turned out poorly, unfortunately. Absolutely. But you know, uh, Val, after being uh, was it like like two two games down, remains undeterred. And yep. serve and and remains steadfast with uh, Shang Wa. B Boy Skyzo is saying he will never feel pity for X getting outranged by a freebie. I don't think anyone here feels pity for this character, but we like Valhanya, so um, cheering for X in this case is fine. <laughs> I mean, it's it's hard it's hard not to cheer for any of these two. But since the Channel yeah. Dragon beat me, I'm cheering for X. They are both just. Fun players to watch. Absolutely. Ah, he's, he's going for the, the, the four Bs to kind of mm -hmm. start a keep out game going, which is a mm -hmm. good idea against Young Wa, mm -hmm. so I can respect it. Well, since you're Ooh. biased uh, towards uh, Valhalla, most likely, I I'm just going to be biased towards the Hey, 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 look, look, look. I, I, I am a huge fan of Eternal Dragon. Like... I know, I know. <laughs> but, but, if we're picking sides, I'm gonna be on the side of the side. I mean, no, 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 it's not. It's not personal, yeah. 
<laughs> nah, it's not first one. But... <laughs> like, like I love you, Megan. Oh, Good there's the uh... four punish. Unfortunate. You know, it it is it is minus minus twenty two. Oh, it gets it by the armor. I love seeing that. Oh, and she ducked. Why are you talking? This no is this is the, the, this is the one thing that almost all players uh, will do against X, and it is that when oh good Ooh, duck into three. What a beautiful C. duck into C. Oh, that the one. The skill special, skill oh, yes. special. But hey, uh, back to the story. It's like whenever whenever someone gets hit by uh, by a crybaby, their first what? reaction, oh, their first my. reaction. Oh, yeah, never that mind. Was a, that was a beautiful reaction with punishing the 3D, not just with any move. But with 2 and This is not an easy move to whiff punish either. Mm. But with a 2 2A, lethal hit. That was a perfect example of uh, good reactions with Mitsu. Just holding this pressure, though. Mercy, I have, I have none. none. Let's see what he does with it. He's in Shura Blade and he has Soul Charge, so this is a really scary situation for Vahanya. Oh, good punish! Yeah, a 1BB, going for the Crouch Grab, very nice. AAA. Still not ducking the 3 AK. Okay. And runs straight the into the 3B. Great. I think the, the biggest thing is still, he's not ducking the, the, the 3 AK at all. Otherwise he's playing it very well, but it uh, mm. that is a pretty big thing that he's missing out on. I mean, like it's it's one of those things where you don't ex well, it, well you wouldn't know like right off the bat that if you get hit by normal hit three A, that you can still duck the K. Nah, that's true. Ooh, oh, oh, nice for for for, for being not getting Valhania out of dodge this time. Second hit of the string is saving him. Oh, he's trying yeah, to find a little oh. bit. Uh, to be fair, what? it could have been worse. Uh, he could have died even harder for trying to reverse mm -hmm. there. <laughs> Oh, 3B. Oh, the punish! Oh. Yes, sniffed think... out! Sniffed out that 3B! Exactly. In in these kind of situations where Valhanya is about to die, um, Turtle this... Dragon gets greedy. He goes for the 3Bs rather than trying to go for like the, the smaller miss, like a BB or a 4KB, perhaps. Mm. But you know, it's like it's like sometimes you you will tend to second guess yourself when trying to yes. use a BB because, as you say before, Valhanya is extremely good at placing her sidesteps. Yes, it is. Yeah, uh, she is definitely. But even uh, even a one game. Just just as we just seen right there. Meanwhile, right. uh, Dragon just laying on the pressure, and I think, why need to pop a meter? Oh, there's gonna be uh, huge damage. Uh, meter, hey, all right. This is gonna be another mix-up, unfortunately. <laughs> Not quite as much damage, let's, but you know, uh, two or three mixes. It. Doesn't uh, do the string. Uh, <laughs> the uh, too patient at the end there, unfortunately. I think, you know, when you're in like last hit scenario and uh, Zhang Hua has the threat of two or three mixes straight, straight away, you, you, you don't know what to do. You have to just block. And yeah. sometimes, you know, uh, one wrong button can cost you as much as just holding down G. Yes, exactly. Uh, Eternal Dragon is definitely the type that will stay patient in situations mm -hmm. like this, but if Valhanya snuffs that out, it's obviously not going to work out in his favor either. Absolutely. Uh, perhaps he needs a bit more healthy mashing in these kind of situations, mm -hmm. but we will see. Maybe he can make the adaptations. I mean, hey, you you you, you play Mitsu, you, you have the frames for it. Good yeah. step! Just uh, letting, uh, well... 3A doing a lot of work for Mitsu, you know, just uh, trying to um, staunch, staunch, uh, snuff out uh, shang -Gua step. Yes. Oh, going for Hold the up. cheeky stand stuff, the mix ups. Trying to make a statement, you know, you, you think you think uh, you have mixed uh, shang -Gua? I have mixed two, I have mixed two. Exactly. They can both just run the, the stance mix up cartel on them. Uh, but with punish on and one more mix. Ooh. Not quite. One more mix for uh, Tunnel Dragon. Oh, and there's a nice. delay! Nobody expects it low from Relic, but there is one. <laughs> this is scary. That was really nice stuff from Eternal Dragon. It, this, is, this is great. You know, uh, we see uh, both players playing small caliber, pressing their, their, their frame. This is soul Look caliber. At this. <laughs> Look at this, though. This character is disgusting. <laughs> Absolutely.
No, uh, very, very neck and neck uh, with uh, each player just uh, just trading blows. But you know, in the most crucial moments, it's Valhania the one that uh, pulls forward almost every time. Yes, exactly, and mostly just uh, rounds wise, they are both doing very well. It's a, it's not a blowout. Uh, mm -hmm. In any way, but Valhanya just in the clutch situations does a much better job right now. Plus two. Rise to step! Ooh, unfortunate. Ooh, I'm trying Ooh. to go for the uh, for the cheeky uh, yeah. stance. Oh, Schmix. good nice punish. Nice. Very nice. No great confirmer from Eternal Dragon. His sats. His sats my nuts. He's <laughs> <laughs> like me in the neutral. Let's go. That's, uh, <laughs> I, I respect it. <laughs> I respect it very much. Uh, that sounds like the kind of move I would pull out. <laughs> well, and you're learning from the past encounter, you know? Good Ooh, win punish! Nice step to G on the stands. That is the big weakness in Relic. Step to G deals with a lot of the options that you could do in uh, Relic. What's the mix? That's and doesn't block the 3A. And as we say before, both players just trading blows, trading Ooh. rounds. Ooh. 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 Nice Go with Fairness, waiting for the second hit. Eternal you can see now. that uh, Eternal Dragon is very much afraid of going for the 1BBs, uh, possibly afraid of going for the 1KBs as well, simply because even on hit, Zhangwa is going to punish you dearly. And I mean, that is not a very nice feeling. I, I mean, I mean you, can't, you can't blame him. It's like, when you... Like, like, if a character can turn one, one of your best oh. lows into reverse mix-up on hit. Yes, it is, it is very painful. <laughs> Perhaps uh, some more throws might be what he's looking for. Uh, uh, and catches him on the back step! Yes. You can't just back step against Zhongwa. It, it's not like that. And no, this players and, may want to make uh, want to make you think that that is the case, but that is never the case. But you know, this is what we explained before, and it is you know, Zhang Gua has that kind of toolkit that yeah. uh, is designed to counter en anything you do. Exactly, and it is it is absolutely um, frustrating to fight against. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Fuck my voice. Yeah, your voice uh, went kind of uh, spoker there. Where? <laughs> don't, don't smoke it. Just sound like zero. <laughs> it's the last thing we want. Oh, oh. He's going back to where <laughs> he's, he's, he's realizing the big downsides that mm. he has when he's playing Mitsu in the matchup. He doesn't want to deal with it. I can respect it. Mm. The thing, I mean, as as we've uh, as we've uh, seen, he does have options with 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 the uh, Mitsurugi. We've seen that you know he can do work with Mitsu. But yes. Huang is the only character that's got any results. And oh. we've been disconnected from Steam again, oh. god damn it! Oh. No. And roll back. And roll back to Steam. <laughs> Holy god shit. Damn. Uh, maybe you need a sip of water, uh, Zero. <laughs> I do, maybe, yeah. That might be a good idea. I mean, can you blame me, man? Dude, this match the hype! Well, Blade, in this case, it's not even Lobby Caliber, it's just Steam. <clears throat> Going away. It's Steam. Oh, it's okay. Steam Invite Caliber. It's Steam Invite Caliber. Man, why has it got to be like this? But you know, as long as as long as we're waiting, by clicking exclamation mark, donate. Yes. Uh, that is that is donate. Do not <laughs> die. <laughs> if you need dinner, uh, exclamation mark, donate for a nice pizza. Uh, but exclamation mark, <laughs> donate exactly like he already typed in. Hey man, I got, I got, I got that whiff recovery. I got, I got that whiff recovery right. Don't. <coughs> right. Uh, so, <coughs> do you have a single reason not to use the co coupon codes. No, no, you don't. So use them. Go ahead. Do it. But hey, but hey, uh, you know, as you said before, you can donate free money. Does even free have to money. be your own money. Doesn't cost you anything. Cost you nothing. Doesn't cost you. Uh, you know, you do. You don't have to go up to uh, 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 up to your mom. And say, mother, I wish to borrow your credit card to donate to these players. And then your mom's gonna be like, no son, I'm just gonna beat your ass. So you know, save your ass. Yeah. And donate they... free money. Exactly. I, I like you could say, okay, sure, but it takes me time and effort. But you're you're sitting here watching this. And the game isn't even on right now. I mean, hey, hey, it takes time and effort to ask your mom. Exactly. And then, and then it takes your mom time and effort 
to beat your ass. So, you know, you because, say you, it's, but, it's win-win. You save yourself. You save yourself the time and effort of being beat down. Save yourself the time and effort of asking your mum. <laughs> Holy shit. Are you okay? Uh, go have a rest. We're in my... <laughs> <laughs> Dude, my fucking voice is gone. <laughs> Dang, what happened? <laughs> I don't know, man. All right. Uh, I'm now <laughs> here commentating with Smoke Zero. <laughs> yeah, man. Fucking taking all these fucking strats from Heaton. He genuinely sounds like he's dying. <laughs> Oh, shit, man. Well, children, this is what Chris wants <laughs> to you. Don't do drugs. Absolutely, man. Don't, <laughs> don't, don't, don't commentate hype, hype sets if your voice can't <laughs> handle it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Are you okay, man? <laughs> like, like, dude. This is what nightmare does to you. <laughs> it's not. This is. It's, it's not even what nightmare does to you, man. Like, dude. I'm like, this is. This is God. <laughs> This is God p- playing revenge on you for trying to buff Nightmare. Alright, you know what? Must why are you dying? Yes, tell us. Tell us, Zero, why are you dying? Well, you know what? If if, if dying is what it takes to get these uh, Nightmare buffs, then I will happily die. Yes. I think uh, Bebo Skyzo <laughs> has uh, hit the nail on the head, but I'm not going to repeat that, because uh, parental advisory uh, don't suggests su- that we shouldn't do that. No, don't that's, su- that's it. Don't no, suck too no, much. No, 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 no. Don't suck too no, much. No. That is not okay for Twitch. The X- there could be children <laughs> watching right now. Even worse, Lionite could be watching. You could scar him for life. Shangwa mains are not ki- uh, ready for that kind of thing. They are pure at heart. Are they? <laughs> well, uh, yeah. That is correct. They don't need to be even more scarred. <laughs> Hey man, sometimes, sometimes it be like that. Mhm. Mind the line, I think Shanghua is cute. I think every Shanghua player does that. Hey man, nobody disses Lionite. Have you seen this man's side boobs? <laughs> Th- these these man's these man's this side boobs. Well, the, these man's side boobs are a thing of beauty. <laughs> well, okay, Lionel in chat is saying that she's the best girl, but okay, we're not no. here to tell lies. Obviously, best girl is Mina, but I can respect the but opinion. Hey, but hey, why, why would he lie? No, I, here's, here's the thing. No, no matter how disgusting the opinion may be, or how disgusting the individual may, may be, I will defend his right to say that John Wai is best girl, even if de- it is a lie. You will defend his right to be wrong. Exactly. <laughs> he has every right to be entirely wrong. Oh, we're still not having it. <clears throat> um, that has to be enough. I can't. I can't n- neither of them. Neither of them are fucking Bisco. Bisco is obviously Hilda. No. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, fucking Hil- Hilda's a basic bitch, and then we've got fucking Tetsuka. Oh, the only reason I'm in the game is because I want to kill Mitsu and do nothing else. Mm-hmm. Uh... L- listen. listen. <laughs> 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 oh, no, 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 no. I still have my favorite character, Patroclus. It's just we have to deal with fucking Alpha Patroclus. Uh, sure. <laughs> fucking piece of shit. Yeah. Hey man, I shoot One steam game. all. I shoot steam all the time. Yeah. Have... <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys, we're going to be taking a short break uh, so that we can, uh, I don't know, resolve these technical issues, and and so that I can, I right. can resolve my fucking voice. As exactly. <laughs> Holy shit, man! We will see you in a bit.
And we are back. Um, let's hope that this is the last time that Steam decides to ruin it for us. Um, Steve Jobs. It seems that Zero is back as well. Uh, it seems his voice sounds a little less fucked up. So uh, I mean, I mean, it. for the moment, I quickly uh, ran down, ran downstairs as quick as uh, quickly as I could. Took mm. some honey. Ah. <clears throat> And then some marmalade. So yes. let's see. Let's see how long it holds up. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, mm -hmm. we still got potential. We still got potential uh, for for more games. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. That means Valhalla needs to speed on it. So you are definitely picking sides this time. <laughs> right at the start. <laughs> <laughs> so you know. Uh, both players have have now had uh, waifu stage, yeah. <laughs> I mean, yeah, Valanya always calls girl waifu. Um, she's right. Welcome to the stage of history. No. Yes. Girl sucks. Geralt is the best Spando in this game. And girl in his own game. The girl sucks. No. <clears throat> hey man, we were talking about this, yeah? No, uh, yeah. some characters have, a, have an I-18 3B. And it's mm -hmm. minus 14. Some mm -hmm. characters have an I-23 B and it's minus 12. Mm -hmm. Some characters have an I-18 3B and it's minus 12. Geralt has the best of both worlds for its I-20 and minus 14. Yes, exactly. That's the kind of two. <laughs> that's the kind of uh, launcher that we need. No, genuinely. That's the kind of launcher we need. Please give this to everyone. Uh, but going back into it, uh, Eternal Dragon going for the Wang. Going for the reverse earring, I don't can respect that at times. A A A. Oh, and there we go, learning immediately. Dragon learning getting, uh, in the middle of the set. Absolutely. Uh, doesn't block the low. With great patience. Oh, uh, what happened there? Um, not quite. Happened. Not quite the same. Not quite the same for uh, Eternal Dragon getting caught off guard by the breaker. And your Val and you're showing off this. This uh, this uh, <laughs> uh, um, broken uh, 3B. Uh, <laughs> 3B, 3B supremacy. 3B supremacy. Oh, staying down, allowing him to get another hit in and some guard damage. Absolutely. And, and you know it's. Oh. And there and there it is. Immediately 40% oh. guard damage. Yes. 60% 4, 4kb is a very very nice beat. sorry sorry uh, 4, 4, 45% 45% guard damage mm -hmm, mm -hmm. excellent Ooh. and once again just Fine. going absolutely ham with that 3 yes <coughs> is that eternal dragon is trying some talisman uh, shenanigans at the start of the round but it's not really working out in his favor at all Ooh, what a nice freebie. Oh, this is, uh, he expected, the uh, he expected a wall splat, so he mm -hmm. expected to get another, uh, yeah, unfortunate. And there's, and there's the 4 4 B getting Valhanya to dodge. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Look at that, that move is un impossible to riff punish properly on reaction. Mm. It is. Oh! oh, that is a very <laughs> creative way to deal with that. That's the uh, first time I've seen that. That's uh, impressive. Nice. Seems that way. Do you be as a follow up? In yes. Soul Charge? Uh, in Soul Charge, it does, yes. I didn't know that. I think, I'm pretty sure it's minus four on block, so, uh, yeah. Oh, Save no. Archers. Ooh. You know, uh, 3B into CE. One more confirm and one more mixer from Val will do it. Yeah. Is it 3A? Is it 6B? Oh, oh, oh he's 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 the down and then he just gets hit. He... I, I, think, I think he just expected to die. I, yes, I think he didn't expect to need to take another <laughs> mix up, but. Also, he maybe he didn't feel like it was necessary. Maybe he mm. felt like it was futile, because that is a very dire situation to be in. But can we just talk about how Huang, who was uh, face down, no face up, head towards, managed to stay out of range for a three A? Oh no, the the three A is in range. It simply does not hit grounded. It is not a ground grounded hitting attack. In case what? Yeah. I didn't know this. 3A, it does not hit grounded. Full, cra full crash 3A does. Oh, um, full so in, that, in that case, it is not rewarding to stay grounded either way because 6B is a complete fourth block, which is ridiculous. Absolutely. But uh, yeah, that is why the mix up works. But uh, mm. yeah, unfortunately, the staying down did not help him <coughs> at all. Ooh, trying to whiff on the But hey, uh, as, as you see now, uh, Valandia is now uh, set. So, uh, quite a mountain for uh, Eternal Dragon to climb. Exactly. Scores being seven to two. 
Let's uh, well, let's hope that he can manage to pull something out of his sleeve, pull something out of his wang. <laughs> Show us why his wang is impressive. <laughs> I for one am very impressed by his wang. <laughs> <laughs> he's gotta, he's gotta show us the dragon. Yeah, he's gotta show us the dragon. And That's why, it. and why it's eternal. <laughs> oh, 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 double KO. KO! Very nice. Draw part. I, I, I respect, I respect the the staying down from eternal dragon. It was a mm -hmm. was a good choice in the end. But it uh, turned out to be a trade. I'm not sure if that mm -hmm. was what he was looking for. He was on a live advantage, but obviously mm -hmm. that doesn't uh, tell us everything. This is wrong with the mix-up. Oh, 4 AA. Counter hit confirmed. Very nice. One of uh, Wang's Minus most Minus iconic Minus. moves. Yes. Uh, back in the days of uh, Soul Calibur 2, I think I've seen it once or twice uh, in that game where it was a natural combo. I... Uh, it uh, was no. Uh, no, I think uh, 4 AA was always a natural combo. No, uh, I mean the whole thing. Uh, it, was it was never a natural combo. Uh, it might have been with uh, the, the special character. What, what was his name? I don't think even then. Ah, uh, like uh, like four a like four AA has always been the natural. Uh. A A uh, B has always been the natural counter. Ah, uh, okay. Mm. I feel like uh, what is it? <clears throat> Assassin was it? I feel like that character had that, but I might. Nope. Be no, oh, like you, besides as, as, not to spend the meter, that was interesting. You could I mean, just uh, CE after the back throw, but it didn't uh, matter. I up. mean, Assassin was in Soul Calibur 2 and it was the exact same. Like uh, three AA was the uh, natural was the natural combo, and then uh, th uh, three AAB was the natural counter. Ah, I might be confused, but yeah. All right, it doesn't matter now. But hey, I Eternal Dragon uh, now wants on the board once again. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> seven to four or seven to three. Let's go. Which, which makes this a 7-3 matchup. <sighs> you make me cry. Um, <laughs> don't fall for this fool's honeyed words. I mean, they're literally honey. I just, I, yes, I, exactly. I, they I, are I, literally I, honeyed. Yes. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not here to tell lies, only the truth. Uh, what the fuck? Yes, he uh, was misaligned on his stance, unfortunately, so that happened. He just, uh, I think, I think I know what Eternal Dragon is doing. He is going minus nine. He is abandoned. He doesn't care anymore. Every single launch he gets, he's just gonna go for four talismans. He's just gonna pay the price every single time. He's just gonna try to get as much damage in as possible. Really nice use of the four AA. Mm. Oh, yeah. Good throw! Good choice, good choice, good choice. I respect it. Decides not to go for anything else, not to go for an aura, but instead goes for the 2 for 6 I respect oh, hey, it. Hey, it, it took his frames and uh, made a, mar a marvelous come round. It seems that uh, Zhang was. Uh, uh, whatchamacallit. Zhang was sidestep is so good that the 6 A plus B just misaligns every single time he tries to do it at a range. Mm -hmm. It's uh, very unfortunate. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> Ooh, good delay on the uh, delay. Not B. going for the combo, unfortunately. But you know what? It's a, it, that, that's a that, that's a really Ooh, nice punish. Very it nice. It is. But you know, we were just about to say how two three six B was a tremendous idea to call out Crybaby. Yes. You know? Yes. Deal oh, deals yeah, a fair definitely. deals a fair bit of damage, and and deals fifteen percent card damage mm -hmm, as well. Mm -hmm. I, I I didn't even think that that was why he did it, but that is actually a very nice point. That is a. Uh, most likely the reason why he keeps going for that. That's a very nice, uh, nice idea. And to make matters even better, like, it, it tech jumps as well. Because, yes. like, a lot of people, like, sort of underestimate the range of the hitbox of Crybaby. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So it's like, you know, you, they try and rip on the chair, and then, you know, uh, all of a sudden, their, their feet get, uh, like, slapped out of the move. Exactly. What I want to see more from <coughs> Colonel Dragon is uh, when the 4-4-B whiffs, is just going for a 6-A-A, mm. simple natural uh, combo. You don't have to worry about they're doing the cancel or not. You can just do the punish, get your reward, mm. stay solid. That's it. It's, it's, it's looking a lot better since Eternal Dragon decided to just go, fuck it, go minus 9. It's working out. <laughs> Absolutely. 
But Valhalla has been getting a lot of these GIs. Uh, last making, absolutely, she's been making like a lot of the correct. Ooh, uh, we got lethal oh, machine lethal gun kicks straight into CE. No, no, it doesn't combo into CE. Oh, step to G into CE, and that is final round. You cannot stop me. Don't chote. I feel, like, I feel like going for the CE that would have been better. Absolutely, but it is what it is. All right, we're gonna life force. All right, he wants he wants the the, the clutch. Mm. He wants a nice lethal hit. S stocked up with the uh, smash wang. Yes. Still not ducking the three uh, three AK, unfortunately. I mean, as we said before, it, like it might be one of those matchup specific things you just don't know. Yes. Where, exactly. I mean, like, like, like it's like it's similar to uh, to move like nightmares uh, three AK way. Uh, on on the. Uh, Oh, oh, the side step into the Z. There we go. <clears throat> Beautiful stuff. He's going a bit too ham with the the vertical attacks, unfortunately. Ab not absolutely. Uh, I, I mean, you know, this is what we said before, and it's like you know, uh, sometimes you want to smaller caliber, sometimes you want to play like like vertical game to stop your opponent from uh, pressing buttons. But Valania, as we've said before, knows how and when to place their steps. Exactly. It's very infuriating to play against. And as we said before, like the more infuriated that you get with the character, the more the more uh, prone you are to just pressing buttons just to stop this character. Mm -hmm. And then and then it's like it then you then you realize in, in in hindsight this is the complete opposite of what you should be doing. Exactly. But um, <coughs> yeah, uh, skill uh, skill. <laughs> I'm not yeah, looking man. at skill quite yet. Even though he's a very nice, uh, a very good player. Um, Eternal Dragon deciding to go back to Skill's character. <laughs> the mid suit. Maybe hey. he has a plan. Maybe he's just doing the Hill Mary at this point. Either way, I respect it. I mean, hey, it's sticking to what he's uh, comfortable with. It's like, you know, uh, Huang, we've seen, does have options. We've seen that Huang can do work. But mm -hmm. you know, your character is your character. Exactly, it, 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 that is definitely the case. Sometimes a counter pick can only uh, work <laughs> against you. Some, sometimes it can only work for so long before you start to flow chart your uh, your options. Exactly. And once again, <laughs> Valhanya demonstrating the superiority of, of a 3B. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I think it's uh, something that's very peculiar is uh, Valhanya doesn't really want to duck in situations where Mitsu has like a, a straight 50-50. Which I can definitely understand because even if she blocks the either of the of his key lows, right? Mm -hmm. It's not like uh, even even if she doesn't block them, right? She still gets reward. Mm -hmm. And I think Eternal Dragon has realized that as well. He just keeps trying to go for the mid. Unfortunately, well, I'm eating my words. I think he found something with the one B A plus B. That might be a nice option. To mm -hmm. Circle this still have a bit of uh, oh. Oh, wow, very nice one, Rosingby. That's a lot of damage. Can Dragon doing work right now? We know where it's a little bit of greedy on the Oki, but uh, mm -hmm. nevertheless, looking a lot, <coughs> lot, lot stronger right now. Absolutely, just taking his frame when he has to. Good throw break. Ooh, good mash. Oh, this might be it. No, it's not. Not quite. No. Oh, good, good punish. Block. Could have punished a bit better, but. Guess he's wrong on the mix up. That's only. It costs him dearly. This could have been a win for him if he decided to see after blocking the 3A. However, being in that situation is not easy. Absolutely. There's like there's only there's only so long your 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 defense can work for, and there's only so many mix ups you can guess right. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Unfortunately, he chose to not do the best possible punish he could have, and it costs mm -hmm. him dearly. Well, both players is playing small caliber and Valania do going in for the mix up. Mercy, I have none. Time for soul charge. Let's see what he got. 3 BB. She isn't ducking. See, there yeah, is the 1 KB. Oh, we're it's gonna it's very noticeable. Even against soul charge, she is very rarely going for a duck. Mm. You know, we've also seen how uh, on, on Oki, uh, Tom Dragon is going for the, uh, for, for, the, for, for the singular 1K just to confirm. That exactly. even if he gets blocked, yeah, you know, like he he understands that the, his opponent is going to be looking for the second and third hits. Exactly, exactly. It's it's a lot less scary to do. 
Absolutely. So it's like, it's like it's it's really insanely good mental frames. Mm -hmm. And now Valhania has stuck with one ball, one good move oh, from Matilda Dragon might do this. A three B. This uh this will be one more confirmed from Eternal Dragon. Oh, and there it beautiful. is. A little bit of stands dancing cancel into one KB. Very nice. Running the mix-ups. But now yeah. Valhadia is not the one stuck with two bars. And we've seen now you if you're minus twelve at any point. Oh yes. It's, it's just what... it's just kidding, boys. Yes. Ooh, very nice bait on the GI. Going for the for the Oki combo. Making all the correct reads right now, calling yes. out every one of Valhania's uh, you can't get too greedy, uh, however. Uh, this is this is the decisive moment. Both players in soul charge. Whoever gets the best out of this. Oh no, he burned the C. No. Oh, well, the C this is the worst case scenario for Eternal Dragon. Both Absolutely. of his bars gone. Now to deal with the mix-up. Oh, and guess is wrong. Ducks. Guess is right, but he was wrong. Yep. And Valani now climbs up uh, to the uh, ninth and possibly final game. Oh, yeah. Ooh, already. But you know, while we're here, by pressing exclamation mark donate, if I typed it in the wrong, in the right fucking chat. Oh, it seems Eternal Dragon is, in, is having a little bit of a uh, character crisis in the middle of this. Not knowing which character he wants to tackle the Jean Wall with. Obviously, the first isn't working, but the second isn't either. Uh, but right <laughs> now, right now he is locked in with Wang. You see, what what I would have done is once I realized that Mitsu wasn't working, what mm. uh, I would have stuck with Wang and just try to get as much knowledge in as possible. Because obviously, Wang is the character he thinks he should be playing in this matchup, but he's simply not as experienced yet. Absolutely. And strong. Dom dominating round for Valhanya in this, uh, the uh, the first round. Valhanya has all the momentum on her side now. Absolutely, the last game was very close, but this this might prove to be fatal for Eternal Dragon. This last mm. swap. Maybe oh, gets caught with the GI, gets too greedy, and baits out. Nothing, yeah. nothing is yeah. going right. Yeah. That was a very nice bait on the GI, that will definitely be a lot of mental damage, but at the same time, she did drop the combo, which is very unfortunate. Alright, now Eternal Dragon is in the live lead. Good For how long? Ooh! Uh, Nani! You can do that! Disgusting! That was disgusting, and I love it. Absolute tremendous call-out! Shades of with the hard reads! Shades of Lionite doing minus 12 into GI just because you know nobody's gonna fucking punish that move. It's true, it's true. We know Valhania on match point! Yeah, oh, Doesn't and she is on a tear. Looking to take it home. Oh, the AAB, everything's working out for her now. Oh, I say that, but. We got Lucan kicks. Rolled by the ball raising beat. Now, one more coming from Val, good throw break! This is the last cry from Eternal Dragon trying to save this set. Going minus nine, it doesn't matter anymore. The, Ooh. the 336k oh, doesn't oh, work. And it. This is death. It's over. But well, Eternal Dragon fight. fighting for survival but wasn't quite enough. Just not enough to dance. Uh, of course, of course it, it had to be the Zhanghua CE to close it out. Obviously. Absolutely. It can't be any other way. <laughs> I think this was a very nice display from both players. Absolutely. This was a very beautiful, uh, well, beautifully done from Valhanya. Mm -hmm. Proving that he is a very, very strong player.